Hey YouTube, so um on a real day E back at you guys again. I hope you guys can hear me. Let me turn down my TV. Um I got my Senegalese twist, as you can see. Um I got it done today. It took like nine hours. I was I got there at 9 a.m. and didn't get home until like 6 p.m. Um, they're pretty medium size. They're not too small, but they're not too big. I'll guys, I'll show you guys the length. But I just want to tell you that a couple weeks ago, maybe two weeks ago, maybe no more than two weeks ago, I relaxed my hair by myself with olive oil. I made a video, but my computer went uploaded, so it basically disappeared, and my hair grew a lot. Um. In June, I cut it. Well, actually, it was a trim, but you know, it got cut to like a bob, but it grew back to like hair, like collarbone. So, and that was only three months. It was like a three month between that trim and my relaxer. So, I was excited that I got that much length within three months. And then, um,. Yeah, so after I took my weave out, I left it in. I left my hair out for two weeks. Um, I basically wore my hair in a bun for those two weeks, and then I deep conditioned my hair last night. No heat, just a shower cap for two hours. I just rinsed it out. I didn't shampoo or anything. But the deep conditioner did get a lot of the dirt on my hair because when I rinsed it out in the shower, I saw all the dirt come out and I guess it had a lot to do with me um really like moisturizing well not moisturizing but um um I don't know like just working the deep conditioner in so I guess it like loosened the dirt that was in my hair and as I rinsed it out it just came out that way and my hair was super duper soft I will be doing deep conditioners like that every week but of course not with my Senegalese twist because I don't want them to, you know, loosen up or mess up as fast. And I mixed my, I did the um, olive oil replenishing deep conditioner with coconut oil, castor oil, and olive oil. And it worked wonders for my hair. And I'm just going to show you how long this is. I don't want this to be a super, duper, a super duper long video. So, it's really long, as you can see. Um, it's in a ponytail, and it's, like, touching the top of my butt. But, um, yeah, I wanted it, well, I didn't want it this long. I wanted it about here, about mid-back length, but it's good enough. I like it. I like it a lot. Um, just want to show you guys a close-up. Let me get some light. Yeah, I like it a lot. Um, the edges aren't too tight, which is amazing because I didn't want that at all. So here's it. Yeah, really long, but I love it. And I guess if you're like in New York. Or Brooklyn, you can ask, you can like message me, comment where I got it from, where I got it done at, and I'll, I'll tell you where I got it done. I got it done at the, um, an African braiding hair salon. And if you want to know, then you can just ask me, and I'll give you, um, the address. Thanks, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.